Oh yes, finally, finally. Well, of course, we're back with another Talking About video. Yeah, we did get some new news right here and stuff like that, of course. Uh, we have Ooh, he's coming to Dragon Ball Legends, you know, super awesome Dragon Ball Super News right there. We have something new for Doken as well, which I'm right, actually really excited for that I've not seen yet that I'm ready to react over for this video, though. So, yeah, let's get started there, of course. Um, really good stuff for this V-Jump to some around, though. I actually do like it myself. Like, this V-Jump, actually, I really do like, though. I like how they have both pages Doken, like, you know, Legends on the top half, Doken on the bottom, because usually, usually Doken first, then Legends, and they kind of vice versa. So switch or whatever though i kind of like that though a little bit i like the tension to detail in this really really good this so of course uh we have well, of course Oob coming to legends he is a yellow unit which is down there i've not seen they're having the typing before like the element or typing whatever um because this is yellow and he uses purple right here is ex can you get that kind but yeah um this is the first time i ever actually like really seeing it going for it like breaking it down myself though but yeah his art looks great it has a regamo interest one you know tree of danger kind of look to it um that art is good. The art is clean and nice. Uh, we have his barrier right there, which we've seen because they have like at least two or more um, different versions of like other characters' animations or animations or whatever. Or Carter. I usually Carter first because they're intertwined. One um, when Dagger was over the five here for um, Doken and stuff like that. That was pretty um, fairly simple and easy, of course. But yeah. Um, his art looks amazing, the chocolate beam looks great, really under disappointing move, because he actually seems really cool, but in like GT, like they kind of messed him up a little bit, because in Super 17, he's supposed to be like one of the strongest people there, he just gets like one shot molly wall, like everybody else in GT, they'll wait, just all wait, it was like, you know, it's way around wait for Goku to do everything, even though Goku's in SK form, he's supposed to be like much weaker, because like a Super Saiyan 3 goes out really fast, and in general, like he's supposed to be a lot weaker or whatever, but he can handle Super 17 and like a Shenmue, we're well, not really Omega though, no one really can handle Omega, which makes sense, he is like, you know, pure, literally Dragon Ball, like, kind of, he's like a Dragon Ball mythical creature, so, it's something. But yeah, I um, he just really gets sweet, and I mean, even in Baby, like, he was on, he's like on Baby level, like, and he's like, you know, beat GT Goku, so, GT can go specifically, so, yeah. And of course, again, Cart looks great, he's coming to Legends and stuff like that, really good. I like how, I mean, it's Cart, again, I love it, this is the 8D image, I thought it was crying for me yesterday, or a couple days, day before yesterday, by the time this goes up already, um, maybe. Um, they did, um, have, I'm trying to think of it, um, Oh, really hot there. Um, they did actually have, um, try to think of it. Uh, they had HD images already out, like a day, kind of like a couple hours later. I'm just recording it with the HD images and stuff like that. Uh, I got some other couple of VGM stuff I want to go over as well, though. Um, I know down here we have, um, EX, um, Gigan Zenkai. It's already in the camera already. And I love how like, like, little Saiyan Kanji right there, like, Super Saiyan and stuff like that. I guess it's some, like, you know, powerful Zenkai coming and stuff like that. I mean, he's already out already, but I'm just recording. He's already out. I'll put him a full breakdown video for him. Probably sooner or later. I don't know when I'm gonna do it though, of course, but um, yeah, the game's already out and stuff like that, of course. Oh, uh, yeah, so, uh, they, they actually do specifically specify it's purple and stuff like that, of course. But, yeah, I'm um, on the big next news right here, which I'm actually really excited about, um, right here. Oh, we got a couple little things here, which I actually keep forgetting. Um, of the auras, like that, but this is the you know, um, outline auras right there, so um, outer, I get outer outline auras. Uh, so of course for Doken right here, a legendary Super Saiyan, I mean legendary Vegeta, I mean Vegeta's finding a legendary event. So like legendary original OG legendary Super Saiyan Goku and GT Goku, Vegeta's finding King is next, which was really big. I feel like Gohan or Fuzik could probably be next, because I would Goku, I don't really, I think, was it Goku that we got that for Goku? Yeah we did. Do we got for Golden Week. So this is our technically second this time, I'm glad glad because it's been like, maybe almost like, like a year-ish since we got Legendary Goku event, it's gonna be getting uh, like a, a variation, so like you know, a version of that event in like this V Jump and stuff like that. So yeah, I think like Vegeta celebrations coming up. So yeah, you know, Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta LR. I'm getting transforming. <laughs> I'm getting. I don't know if they got another GT Goku type of Vegeta maybe coming with this. It makes sense. Yeah, Goku Day we got um, yeah, another Goku Day we got um, Legendary Goku event. GT Goku we got during Golden Week, so it could be a Vegeta esque. Doku Fest event coming soon. Oh, we got new Pets on Battle skins right here. I think it's Series 3, I believe, or Series 4, or whatever. Um, for the goal is Series 1 and 2. I think this is like 4, I believe, the 6 Pets on Battle coming for JP. So that actually is really good though there. Um, next thing we work on some off real quick. Oh, really hot where I am. But yeah, um, this is um, Cell Saga. That LL Gohan art looks really good. Got by, I got Goku, looks funny. He's got like the Hercule on flashback thing, but they're playing it in the blue arc. They all have like big costumes on, kind of like that. First form sale. We got some LR arts here, not LR Loki. But yeah, his is like from the um, One Piece Treasure Cruise crossover. Uh, we have Legendary Vegeta event, um, Legendary Vegeta event, uh, Legendary 
um, event Vegeta thumb icon right there for the game, so you know that. Yeah, that's actually Planet Vegeta, not Earth, because Goku's Earth this is Planet Vegeta right here. Um, a little attention to details, I actually put that there, though. So, yeah, uh, that's pretty much Dokens in a nutshell, though. Um, Dokens and Legends kind of rolled into one. Vegeta art looks great, both of them look really good in the high quality images and stuff like that. The thumbnail would be kind of weird to do, but overall, though, quite good. I like that. It's actually really simple and fairly easy to um, understand the golfer, so, um, yeah. I'm kind of like it there, though, of course. But, um, yeah, though, really, really good stuff right there. Really, really good stuff. So, um, yeah. Um, then, of course, we're here for, um, um, the Xenoverse. I kind of like the concept of stuff in here. Xenoverse 2, they're getting full power of Jiren. I was thinking Ella full power of Jiren. I'm full power of Jiren right here. We got screenshots of him doing his all white, uh, and stuff like that. The raging eyes right there. Looks really weird in the Xenoverse 2 format. But, yeah, his model looks really, really shiny. He has, um, you know, a white, uh, flame wave. Um, I think it's supposed to be the callback to like the Jiren and you know, like DLC and stuff like that because this originally did come out for V Dub. I did a video on it a couple years ago. Oh, but if I find out, I'll probably put up somewhere in the video. I might always forget. Uh, we have, of course, a couple of new outfits, DLC outfits. Uh, his Boma's original outfit. It'd be cool to bring in the yellow one, like from the you know, yellow hair, yellow outfit, purple hair from like the um, movie. Uh, that'd be kind of cool. And this right here also is GT Trunks. No, GT. This is Super Saiyan Trunks outfit when he wore at the end of the Z, like that whole arc before Ubu comes in. Kind of like a little, kind of like a little callback. It is for weird because a lot of DLC end off with Ubu. Like, yeah, it's the final DLC for Xenoverse. At this point, Xenoverse 2, I'm mean, Xenoverse 2, yeah. So at this point, Xenoverse 2 isn't like ending at this point. A lot of people really want Xenoverse 3. As I was thinking about that, I was doing the um, Killer Avatar event. We had to go online, you know, the raids and stuff like that. You had to do more legends. Actually, it was really fun. Um, First, I'm going through it and stuff like that. Um, I just started doing it now because, again, I just got Xenoverse 2 around like last year because, whew, man, just again, a lot of process game. That game was crazy. But yeah, I'm enjoying it. I think it's fun um, overall, though. Um, but yeah, um, that's kind of crazy right here for getting um, both of our gear. See, I might put him and put the other one in each jump. You know, mainly going over Doke and stuff. I'd rather just kind of put this in a little bit more of that. Um, I think right here is, I believe, more Dragon Ball Hero stuff if you're into this kind of thing. So I know a lot of people um, kind of are into Dragon Ball Heroes and stuff like that, of course. Uh, we have UI Goku right there. We have Cell. We got Buhan. Uh, Paragus from Dragon Ball Super Broly. Uh, we got a couple of other ones in here. We have uh, GT's Resident Evil Goku. Uh, it's, it might look kind of fat there a little bit. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not gonna be tripping. Uh, we have Xeno, Trunks, Pan. We have um, Fugao Time. Coming how Goku and Ultimate Gohan from Dragon Ball Super. We got Goku right here. Buhan, Paragus, um, Father Son, Gohan, um, Father Son, um, Kamen, Hulk, Goku, and um, Little Key Dragon Ball Super, you know. I said kind of like that. It's kind of cool. Uh, Xeno, Trunks, Pan, Speak Out of Time, all these universe characters, Cell, GT Goku, which got, these guys, like, these guys all make sense because, I mean, these all make sense, but they really blew home repair for so I think it's just showing all the Dragon Ball heroes. They might come back on soon. It was kind of like, do this big kind of thing that would bring them back, kind of like, you have Goku again, of course, um, Mass Rose, I think, um, I feel like it was, I think it's like this, it usually goes like this one. I think this one loaded up for me first. I don't know where that kind of came from, though, but, um, yeah, Master Jose, yes, can't wait for that to be coming. Um, Doki, which they kind of did it last year. I think they had like Mass on um, here, like Mass on. Um, they had they had some update pretty quickly. We got all Super Saiyan fours. We got Mass on um, King Vegeta. Pretty all the stuff like all uh, kind of updated stuff that got like in maybe early 2017, 2018. 2015, whatever. I kind of go back and forth from that. I go to Goku, of course. I like the silver hair with the black shirt on. I actually look really cool. I feel like that Goku black instead of um, Goku black, like, um, you know, it's black instead of blue. They would just like blue instead of, you know, blue. It, it's a dark white hero design, but they're kind of used combined, which actually looks pretty cool. It feels weird seeing Goku, like, you know, black clothing. The other thing of Goku black, yeah. These are going to see Cat Cry just coming on the switch and stuff like that. Uh, stuff we already know about um, um, characters and stuff like that, the DLC. Uh, stuff we already got and stuff like that, of course. But yeah, pretty much could go ahead and end the video there. Like I said, I didn't want to make this very, very long ago, but from the various stuff we got in some update, of course, for Doki. I know they're not talking about Doki and whatever, but we got more Dragon Ball Hero stuff. We got more Universe 2 stuff, which again, I don't think they really did at this point, though. But yeah, we got, Ooh, of course, coming to Legends. We got new Legendary like, yeah, event, which I'm really excited about. I knew, again, it's going to be like the same thing with the like, Legendary Doku event. I feel like they were kind of waiting for Evolution Blue Vegeta to come out, because we got, like, you know, I wonder if they got Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta. It seems like it's going to be mainly Armor Vegeta, not like the Majin Blue Arc Vegeta. Yeah, because Dark Ball Super, he has, like, all his full forms. Yeah, because. Did you go through all his forms? Goku goes, yeah, could be a Dragon Ball Super Goku at the beginning. I'll probably like Dragon Ball Super Vegeta. I might just get, like, use that as base form. Uh, go, of course, Super Saiyan. They're about to do Super Saiyan 2. Maybe Super Vegeta. Then Super Vegeta, Super Saiyan 2. Um, they'll probably go, like, God, then Blue. They're, no, God, Blue, then Evolution Blue. They might honestly do that, though. 
but yeah, pretty much I'm ending it there. I get so much stuff that I can do that, man. I'll probably be in the next update coming up soon. I'm um, forgetting and stuff like that, though. But um, yeah, though, um, a lot of good stuff coming to Dokken and Legends and stuff like that. So yeah, see you guys later, though. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Good luck. Welcome to Dokken, though. Stay safe. Stay safe. Watch your hands. God bless all of you. I'll put one mask on. Club it. Thank you. What you guys think about all this? I'm of course. <laughs> I'm really excited for like doing Vegeta event and Uber. Of course, if we jump, I'm really happy. I'm really excited to see what's on both in the future and stuff like that. Though. So, yeah. Enough wasting your time, enough going on. So, yeah. See you guys later, though.